<laughs> What's up guys? Today we're gonna to show you how to get the perfect finish and protection on your carbon fiber parts. So the biggest problem that we have when we were buffing a car is all the residue that it leaves around. A lot of times it'll leave like white bits. It'll sling on everything. There's a little bit on my, two, on my 240Z right now. Um, and you'll get pinholes and stuff like that in your parts sometimes, you know, it's your first part, you're just figuring it out, but you wanna buff it and make sure it's like nice and shiny. If you buff over a small pinhole, it'll fill it, it'll be bright white and it'll look terrible. So fiberglass hit me up and said that they're now carrying Pie Boat Composites. It's an Italian company, P-A-I. Um, and they have a three stage buffing system that is black instead of white. So all the white residue and crust that gets left on a buff part, you don't have to worry about it. You can just wipe it off, and if there's any little residue, it'll just be black, it's perfect. Um, the way that we would start is just like anything else. We have three coats of clear on this. You can see it's kind of got like a weird texture, not a weird texture, but it's a little bit of the texture from the weave, and a little a couple of like dirt specks from our booth. So we're gonna go ahead and sand this with 2000 grit. We're gonna do that just dry. And uh, then we're gonna follow it up by 3000 grit with the water wet sanding and then wipe it all down and then we'll get to buff. So, like I said, it's a three-stage buffing compound. So, whatever this NW1 plus black, it's stage one. They should put a one on it, but you know, it's, it's fine. It does say max cut, that's what you want. Uh, I have the white pad on the buffer. Again, we've sanded to 3,000. You could go farther if you wanted, but blue. Oh my god, that's a little Hey, you went gloop crazy. Just get that over there, it's fine. Okay, so now we finished up with the first stage, the cutting compound. Now we're moving on to top finish two, black again. Um, has slightly less cut and more finish. Easy enough to read, right? Get a nice little gloop on there. So it's more like a jelly gray. And we're using the black pad or gray pad instead of the white pad. Pretty good shine on here from the second step. Um, you could really stop here if you wanted, but we're gonna go third step. This is the Easy Gloss Black. These all sound the same to me. <laughs> but this one has the least amount of cut and the most amount of finish. That max finish. Extra fine. <laughs> so, I'm gonna go ahead, hit this with one coat of this. Black pad, same thing as before see the results. Okay. 
and there we have it. All three steps done. It looks really good. Super happy with the finish. And I don't have any little white specks all over me or all over all these cars. So I'm very happy that Fiberglass thought of us and sent this over to us for us to test. Um, you can get it at fiberglass.com.